Rebecca Rabbit. It is the end of another lovely day. <laughs> Peppa and George are playing with their friends, Rebecca and Richard Rabbit. Home time, my little bunnies. Oh, but we want to play some more, Mummy. Maybe tomorrow. Can Peppa and George come to our house tomorrow? Yes. Hooray! <laughs> Why is Richard crying? He's a bit scared of going downstairs. Why? We don't have stairs in our home. What? No stairs? That's right. You'll see tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> It is morning. Peppa and George are going to Rebecca Rabbit's house today. <laughs> Mummy Pig can drive, and I'll do the map reading. Are you sure, Daddy Pig? We always get lost when you do the map reading. <laughs> we won't get lost. Okay. Is everybody ready? Yes, yes Mummy Pig. Pig. Then let's go. Peppa and George are very excited. They have never been to Rebecca Rabbit's house before. Daddy, are we nearly there? The map says Rebecca's house is on the next hill. I don't understand. This should be where Rebecca Rabbit lives. We must be lost. There's just this garden of carrots. Where can Rebecca Rabbit's house be? Squeak! Hello, everyone. Squeak! Squeak! <laughs> Rebecca, do you want to play in my bedroom? Your bedroom? But where is your house? Peppa cannot see Rebecca's house anywhere. This hill is our house. It's called the burrow. Ooh! I'll show you. See you later. See you later. <coughs> Come in. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have stairs. We have tunnels. Wow! Rebecca's house is a bit different to Peppa's. This is our bedroom. Wow! You have a bed. And a window and a toy box, just like us. Of course. <laughs> I like your house. I wish I was a rabbit. I know. Shall I teach you both how to be rabbits? Yes, please. <coughs> First, you have to twitch your nose and squeak like this. Squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeak. <laughs> Very good, Peppa Rabbit and George Rabbit. <laughs> Peppa likes being a rabbit. George likes being a rabbit. Rabbits like carrots. Delicious. Nom, 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 nom. Delicious. Yuck. George does not like carrots. He won't even try them. Oh, well, more for us then. <laughs> Rebecca, what else do rabbits like? Rabbits like hopping. Come outside. I'll show you. <laughs> Let's hop. Rabbits like hopping. You're very good, rabbit. Lunchtime, children. <laughs> Mummy and Daddy Rabbit have prepared lunch. Squeak. Rebecca has taught us how to be rabbits. Squeak, squeak. Ho oh, ho! You'll enjoy lunch then. It's our favourite, carrots. Delicious. Delicious. Yuck! George will not eat carrots. Oh dear, George! I thought you were a rabbit. Rabbits love carrots. Hmm. Wow, George is eating a carrot. <laughs> and this is our favourite cake. Carrot cake. Hooray! Mmm, carrot cake. <laughs> George is a proper rabbit now. Squeak, squeak! <laughs> Nature trail. Today, Peppa and her family are driving out to the countryside. Daddy, what will we see in the countryside? We'll see birds and trees and flowers and bees. <laughs> Dinosaur. No, George. I don't think we'll see any dinosaurs. <laughs> this is the start of the nature trail. We're here. Hooray! <laughs> Daddy Pig, 
Don't forget the picnic. Oh, oh, as if I would. Daddy, how do we know which way to go? Easy. The map says there should be a sign showing the start of the nature trail here. Well done, Daddy Pig. <laughs> oh dear, Daddy Pig has forgotten the picnic. Peppa, what interesting things can you see? Just trees and trees and more boring trees. <laughs> Peppa, you're not looking hard enough. All right. I'll look really hard, and I still won't see anything. Oh, what's that? Peppa has found some footprints. Whose footprints are these? Dinosaur. Oh, George, they're not dinosaur footprints. Let's follow the footprints and see who made them. Yes. <coughs> Shh. We have to be very quiet so we don't scare anything away. Yes, Mummy. George. <coughs> <laughs> Peppa and George are following the footprints. Look! The footprints were made by a little bird. She's flown into a tree. Where? Here, Peppa. Look through the binoculars. The binoculars make everything look bigger. I can see one, two, three baby birds. Ah! Oh, I wonder what they're eating. Yeah! They're eating worms. That's this. <laughs> George has found more footprints. Ooh, what little footprints? The footprints are being made by ants. They're collecting leaves to eat. Are they going to have salad for lunch? <laughs> yes. Talking of lunch, let's have our picnic. Oh, the picnic. Daddy Pig. You've left the picnic in the car, haven't you? Uh, yes, but it's not a problem. We'll just go back to the car to eat. But which way is the car? My map will show us. This way. Oh, who put that tree there? It's not on the map. Oh, Daddy Pig, we're lost, aren't we? Uh, yes. How are we going to find our little car? <laughs> George has found more footprints. What big footprints? Dinosaur. Very interesting. What? Has George found some real dinosaur footprints? No. These are our footprints. And if we follow our footprints, we'll find the way back to our car. And our picnic. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Nothing can stop us finding our car now. We're home and dry. Oh. I wasn't expecting that. Luckily, I remembered the umbrella. The rain is washing the footprints away. How are we going to find the car now? And our picnic. <laughs> it's the ducks. They always turn up at picnics. Sorry, Mrs. Duck. We haven't got a picnic this time. We can't find it. <laughs> I know. Mrs. Duck, can you help us find our picnic, please? <laughs> We're here! Hooray! Thank you, Mrs. Dunn. <laughs> I love nature trails. Yes, and I love picnics. And the ducks love picnics. And the little birds love picnics. And the ants love picnics. Everybody loves picnics. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and her friends are at their playgroup. Children, who would like a pen pal? Me! What's a pen pal? A pen pal is a boy or girl you can write letters to. This little girl lives in France. Her name is Delphine Donkey. Can Delphine Donkey be my pen pal? Of course, Peppa. Hooray! <laughs> It is early morning. Mr. Zebra the postman is delivering a letter to Peppa's house. Post! Peppa and George <laughs> love it when the post arrives. It's addressed to Miss Peppa Pig. That's me. <laughs> Mummy, can you read it for me? Of course. It's from Delphine Donkey. My pen pal. <laughs> What does she say? Bonjour, Peppa. 
Comment ça va? Mummy, why are you saying those funny words? It's French, Peppa. It means hello. How are you? What else does she say? Hmm. I'll help. J'aime les princesses et jouer avec mes amis. <laughs> Clever, Daddy. <laughs> I am an expert at French. What does it mean? Um. Daddy Pig cleans his glasses so he can see the letter more clearly. Hmm. It's no good. It's nonsense. It means I like fairy princesses and playing with my friends. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> I want to talk French. Maybe you could talk to Delphine Donkey. How? Her phone number is on this letter. Yippee! <laughs> Bonjour. Est-il possible que Peppa parle à Delphine? Mummy Pig is asking if Peppa may speak to Delphine. Hello. Bonjour. Bonjour. Um, what do I say next? Comment ça va? Comment ça va? <laughs> bye bye. Au revoir. Au revoir. What did she say? She spoke French. <coughs> Bonjour, George. Comment ça va? Peppa is saying, how are you, in French. Dinosaur. No, George. That's not how you speak French. <laughs> it is morning. Mr. Zebra the postman is delivering letters to Peppa's house. Post! Hooray! Can I have my letter from Delphine, please? Sorry, Peppa. There's no letter for you today. I wonder who that could be. Bonjour, I am Delphine Donkey. <coughs> oh, I have come to see Peppa. It's Delphine. Bonjour. <coughs> Bonjour, Peppa. <coughs> oh, here are my mama and papa and my brother Didier. Bonjour. <coughs> oh. Here are my mummy and daddy and my little brother George. Hello. Hello. <coughs> Dinosaur. <coughs> Dragon. <coughs> <coughs> <laughs> Do you speak French, Mr. Pig? I'm an expert at French. Ah, parlons sport. J'adore l'équipe de foot de Paris. Quelle est votre équipe de foot préférée? Um, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Delphine, we could jump up and down in muddy puddles. Delphine does not understand Peppa. J'adore sauter dans les flaques de boue. Peppa does not understand Delphine. Everything's so Different in French, Daddy. Oh, come on, Peppa. <laughs> J'adore sauter dans les flaques de boue. Ah, that's what I was going to show you. We call it jumping up and down in muddy puddles. <laughs> oh, J'adore jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Everyone in the whole world loves jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Peppa and George are playing at Granny and Grandpa's house today. Hello, Grandpa Pig. Papa Egg. Oh, ho. hello, Peppa. Hello, George. Bye-bye. <laughs> See you later. See you later. <coughs> Where's Granny Pig? Hello, my little ones. That is Granny Pig's voice. But where is she? Granny Pig. <coughs> Here I am. Granny Pig. Gangy Egg. Why is Granny in the roof? We're tidying the attic. What's the attic? It's where we keep all our old things. Like you, Grandpa Pig. Ha ha! Things that are even older than me. <laughs> Can we help? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Granny and Grandpa's attic is at the very top of the house. That's the door to the attic. How do we get up there? I have a clever trick. Hello, my little ones. It's Granny. Come on up. Ooh. <laughs> this is our attic. Wow. It's very full. Yes, it's full of old junk. <laughs> <laughs> 
Pepper and George are here to help us throw some things out. Good. Let's start by throwing out this box. Oh, not that box. Do we really need this? That's my ship in a bottle. And this? That's my other ship in a bottle. And these? They're my other ships in bottles. I need them all. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have to throw something out. Uh, how about this box? No, not my hats. <laughs> 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 oh dear, we can't decide what to throw out. I know. We'll let Pepper and George decide. Okay. <laughs> Let's throw away this old case. Oh, oh not, not that, that one. one. This isn't just any old case. It's a record player. Ooh. And this was our favourite record. Can we play it? Yes. Oh, oh we haven't heard it for years. Oh, this takes me back. <laughs> Come on, Pepper and George. Let's dance. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy Pig is here to pick up Pepper and George. Hello. Where are you? Mummy Pig can't find anyone. What's that noise? <laughs> Mummy! Hello. We've been dancing to Granny and Grandpa's favourite record. Yes. Huh? Granny and Grandpa played it all the time. Ooh. And here's the record I used to play when I was a little piggy. What is it? It's called Birdie Birdie Woof Woof. Not Birdie Birdie Woof Woof. You were always playing that. I thought we'd thrown that out ages ago. <laughs> the birds go woof and the dogs go tweet. Woof, tweet, woof, tweet, woof, woof, woof. The sheep go moo and the cows go ba. Moo, ba, woof, tweet, woof, ba, moo, tweet, woof, woof, woof. <laughs> <laughs> again, again. <laughs> The birds go woof, and the dogs go tweet. Tweet. Woof, tweet, woof, tweet, woof, 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 woof. The sheep go moo, and the cows go ba. Moo, ba, woof, tweet, woof, ba, moo, tweet, woof, woof, woof. That was fun, but we were supposed to be finding some things to throw out. Pepper, what should we throw out, and what should we keep? Hmm, I think you should keep. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> the coral. Pepper and Susie Sheep are playing snap. Snap! I win. <laughs> Pepper and Susie are best friends. <laughs> snap! I win again. <laughs> You cheated. I did not. You looked at the card. I did not. I don't want to play with you anymore. I don't want to play with you anymore. Oh dear. Pepper and Susie have had a quarrel. Mummy Sheep is here to take Susie home. Pepper, say bye bye to Susie. I am not talking to her, and I'm not talking to her. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure they'll make it up. They are best friends, really. It is not funny. We are not best friends anymore. Daddy Pig is making supper. Pepper, George, supper time. It's spaghetti. <laughs> What's the matter, Peppa? Peppa and Susie have had a little quarrel. Oh. But I do miss Susie a bit. Hmm. Let's give Susie a call. <coughs> Hello, Mrs. Pig. <coughs> May Peppa talk with Susie, please? Hello, Susie. Hello, Peppa. We can be friends again, if you say sorry. I'm sorry I said you cheated. Even though you did cheat. Well, I'm sorry you were ever my best friend. 
Oh. It doesn't matter. I can easily find a new best friend. It is a lovely sunny day. All the children are at the playground. Danny Dog is on the roundabout with his best friend Pedro Pony. George is on the seesaw with his best friend Richard Rabbit. Seesaw, seesaw. <laughs> Susie Sheep is on the swings, on her own. <sighs> Peppa is playing mini golf, on her own. <sighs> Here is Emily Elephant. Can I have a go? Yes. <laughs> Emily. Susie Sheep is not my best friend anymore. So you can be my best friend. But my best friend is Candy Cats. Oh. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Wee. Zoe, if you want, you can be my best friend. But my best friend is Rebecca Rabbit. Oh. Wee. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Susie. Hello, Peppa. Ah, good. I see you two are friends again. We are not friends. We will never be friends again. Hmm. I think it's about time you two made it up. Peppa, say sorry to Susie. Only if she says sorry first. Only if she says sorry first. I know. I'll count to three, and you can both say sorry at the same time. All right. One, two. Three. Sorry. Now you can be best friends again. Hooray! <laughs> Susie, let's play mini golf. Good idea. Peppa and Susie are best friends again. Me first. My go. My ball went in the hole. So I win. But my ball knocked it in. So I win. You're just making the rules up. You are making the rules up. I win. No, I win. <laughs> you two are just the same. <laughs> That's why Susie's my best friend in the whole world. <laughs> and Peppa is my best friend in the whole world ever. <laughs> <laughs>